It's jam night. MK? Hi. Where are we at? Where are we at? We are actually at... No, just front room. We're in my front room in the mansion. That the mansion. so weird to say that. It does. We're in Nigel's front room. <laughs> We're so used to being out and about with everybody with all the great talent. But you know what? There's a few great talents that we have met that we just absolutely just love and just, you know, want to nurture and just want to, you know, be a part of their career. Yes, yes. You know, and one of those guys is here. Yeah. Right now. I personally know this man. I personally know He's this man. He's one of my best friends. He's one of my best friends. That's awesome. Right? So, you know what, guys? We're going to introduce you to Matt Daly. Matt Daly.
lost in the time Another four walls of comfort and I hope we can find tonight And I don't know if we were meant for this Determined, and I can raise up my fist, but you know I will never be so certain. What's the use if I'm a leech and you're always just oh so vacant? That's I ever speak about these moments until I'll end. I'll end. can find a flop Scrap for coins beneath those tattered cushions tattered cushions so far from our stars so lost in the nights be dread now we'll live with this like our headstones predetermined I can raise up my fist but you know I'll never be so certain What's the use of finally shit? You're always just oh so vacant. Let's not ever speak about these moments until I rent. Fair to 
change the seasons. It's jam night. We're talking about spotlights. We're talking about spotlighting talent. We're talking about spotlighting absolute incredible musicianship and just all around good people. People that we think that are just going to just make an impact. If not here, somewhere else. I mean, you know, there's just amazing talent in this area and we're just trying to spotlight. So that's what this very show is about. I mean, you're supposed to time you see us most of the time, what, out at the bars, out having fun. He's usually getting drunk, being a violent psychotic. But you know what, hey, that's all right though. I mean, we forgive her, we won't forget, but we do forgive her. So, but anyways, so MK. Yeah. Who, again, we just heard from. Matt Daly. Matt Daly, everybody, again, Matt Daly. Hello. Dude, incredible Hello. set, dude. That Thank was awesome. Thank you very much. Lo so Thank what were the names of those songs? Uh, the first song is Common Ground, which okay. is an original, of course. Uh, What's that about? That song is about being stuck in the middle and feeling like you can't get over that hump. Okay, awesome. Who hasn't felt that, right? You know. Right. So, okay, so the second song was what? Um, that would be Predetermined. Predetermined. Which is a very special song to me. Um, I dedicated to a friend who's actually no longer here with us. Um, it's a very personal piece, so for me to play it, it's a very, it's an honor. Definitely. Well, we, I tell you what, now, from all, we definitely appreciate it. I mean, we, we're at, it's an honor for us. To be, you know, you. In, you know, around such talent. So, absolutely. So, you know, we, we're doing this uh, shows like these special spotlight shows. Um, we got another one with Pulp Friction that's going to be coming up. It's going to be really cool. They're going to be playing a full, like, four songs of interview just like this. So we got that coming up. Yep. And then, but MK and me, we sat and talked. We're like, man, how can we be different? How can we like impact or you know and move the talent forward a little bit? So we came up with like five just random questions that we thought would be, you know, kind of interesting to see, to hear from the musician, from the artist itself. So okay. I'm going to hand it over to MK and she's going to ask these incredible questions. I had nothing to do with them, I'm sorry. What? I just, what, go ahead. He's so weird. <laughs> anyway. Aren't we all? <laughs> question number one. What was the first concert you ever went to? Leonard Skinner, fifth grade. Ten years old, Star Plaza, Maryville, Indiana. Awesome. Nice. That's awesome. Heck yeah. What yes. year? So I'm 32, it's 2021, I was 10. 10 years old. And my ears like bled. I enjoyed it, but I <laughs> cried. And my dad had to carry me out and he was like, oh, I thought I knew this was too soon. Oh and my God, it wasn't go. tense. It wasn't, yeah. <laughs> Family bonding over Leonard Skinner, who knew, right? Right. 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 <laughs> so what's question number two? Number two, what was the first album you ever owned and what medium was it on? CDR, Michael Jackson. Thriller. Nice. Nice. Heck yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a really scratched up CDR and I was a, I'm, I'm still a huge, like I love Jackson 5, but Michael Jackson's. Oh yeah. I mean, you can't be. Hits me deep still. <laughs> yeah, the king of pop, right? I don't know. Right, right. So. Three. How old were you when you wrote your first song? Oh wow, that's a good question. Um, I think I was 11. Yeah, I was 11 because I played in front of my fifth grade class. So 10 or 11. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, that was like a talent nice. show, like you just came in like little talent and... I actually, um... What did you book that with the teacher? I did. That's such a good way to put it. That's such a good way to put it. Yeah, I actually like played for my fellow classmates. I like learned open chords by myself and uh, yeah. Nice. Do you remember cool. what song you played? There, 
kind of like I've turned that like I actually did reasons was the third song okay that I did that I kind of like let it you know um, go together and wind together two songs rather but um reasons was kind of like what I was playing then nice. it was e minor very cool. Well, I mean, like, oh, what? E minor. Yeah. Right. Like, you know, Very emotional. Just imagine, I mean, he's 10 years old, you know, when he's writing songs. I mean, that's, that, that, you know, craftsmanship comes out from here, you know, all these years later, you had a full completed song that you played, you know? Right. And it's right. where it starts, you know? Okay, so what's the next question? Four. Do you think that the environment or neighborhood that you grew up in influenced your music in any way? That's a good question. Yes. I grew up in Hobart, Indiana. Um, very much like a middle class type neighborhood but you know every good neighborhood has problems and i was around a fa around a lot of families that were like lower middle class and and the struggle you know like i remember just a lot it, it was it it's like any community really it's um it's tight knit very tight knit so all my friends were supportive with music so yeah it impacted me like in a good way Awesome. Mm -hmm. Very, very cool. Okay, five. I know Matt personally, so I know he's a skateboarder. What is the craziest combo or move <laughs> you ever did on a skateboard without hurting yourself? Oh, without hurting myself. Without hurting yourself. Um, we're going to go with frontside shove it crooked ground 180 out. The what? Wow. Oh. What was, what is that? <laughs> That's a complex combination move. Yeah. I mean, when I'm skating, I do like triple flips in the air, land on my side, right. roll down. <laughs> which I've saw. Which, yeah, I mean, that is on tape somewhere. Skate. Roll down, right? yeah. down yeah. straight onto the stretcher that they roll right into the ambulance right. that takes you to the ER. See how it escalates? She put me in the ambulance. Look at that. She's the one that loosened the wheels. I'm telling you, that day when I knew something was up, something was fishy that one day. Because remember, we were out skateboarding and stuff like yeah, that. We were picking up chicks. We hit the streets. You know? yeah. We hit, hit the streets. So, you know, I'd be we were on doing, a bike or we're, walking. We were doing like half pipes my feet. and yeah. stuff, like off the um the at the pipes. um I'd love off to the see quarter you pipes. Do yeah, off the quarter pipes. Off the quarter pipes. And like the three yeah. inch pipes. And then I'd we love were, like, to see him on a skateboard <laughs> doing these things. He's got vans right. on. We're see, look at that. Look at that. If we I, go. You know, how can I not be a how can I not be a skater? I'm not I'm wearing vans. That's a that's skater right there. Right. But anyways guys, enough about all of that skating so that stuff. Was that. Awesome. that was a good question. We went off on that. Okay. That's awesome. That was cool. So now again, you and I are the king and queen of tangents. Right. Yes. I, I like it though. It's okay. Fun. That's good. So again guys, spotlight shows. Spotlight it's it's about giving the artists the time. You just have to know Matt Daly a little bit more. You just got to hear someone who's incredible music. Where can they follow you? Can they follow you? Can they? Yeah, um, I'm on, of course, like social media mediums like Facebook, um, YouTube, Food on Your Plate. It'll be my EP that'll be dropping once uh, the time is right. Instagram. I have an Instagram handle, yeah, I don't even remember it. Matt Daly. <laughs> I think it is. It's like Matt, yeah, uh, it is. Facebook, da Matt Daly Music. Um, yeah, so just check me out. Like I said, youtube.com backslash food on your plate for any uh, up-to-date videos and stuff like that. There you go. Yeah. MK? Yeah. Again, Matt Daly right here. Yeah. Just absolutely fantastic. Awesome, but kind of crazy. Again, we yeah. are, again, guys, we have Pulp Friction coming up. They're going to be doing like four songs, full band, everything. It's good that I'm, my, we're going to get blown away on that. Right That's going to be incredible. And then yes. we're going to be talking to the band. We're going to yes. be asking them some questions, just like we asked I got like some good them. questions. And that, you know, so incredible talent coming up, incredible music, guys. Again, it's jam night. It's spotlight. It's jam night. It's jam, jam night. night. We'll be back here in a little, in, real soon. Real soon. Bye.